Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Nightcap Gamer. My name is Josh, and tonight we're playing some more Lord of the Rings Online. That's right, I'm back for another thrilling episode with yours truly, as well as our good friend Al, um, and also some other people over here who are just kind of hanging about, doing their thing, uh, which I'm okay with. Now today I've picked up a lot of quests, and um, we're going to try to take care of some of these. These are all like um, pretty far above me, level 30 and 31 quests. Um, but I'm just going to try to uh, burn through them. Um, I think my main goal today is to defeat Gloomleaf, the Fallen Oak. Um, there's some cool rewards, including the Span of the Brown Wizard, which gives me plus 18 vitality, which I could really use right now. Uh, I think it would be really valuable um, at this stage in the game, because I'm kind of hurting. I'm kind of hurting in some of my fights. So I'm going to sneak on in through the Red Pass into Agamar. Look, Gloomleaf's way up here, um, and there's lots of other quests. Some shambling whites hanging about. Um, let's just move right on in. Um, we'll see how it goes. I hope you guys are doing well tonight. Um, I myself am doing particularly well. It's been a nice day. Um, and I'm very excited to get my killing on. Get my burgling on, right? Should we try to burgle some of these whites? You think they're carrying anything on them? I know there's a bunch over here. Let's go check it out. Do I get... Yeah, see, I do have a quest. Oh, I have a deed as well. Very cool. Um, let's sneak up behind this guy. Let's try to burgle him. Which one? I forget which one it is. Okay. Now burgle him. Ineffective against that target. And he's noticed me. Okay. So that didn't work out too well. I guess they're not carrying anything on them. I mean, they'd have to be hiding it like... Like down here somewhere. <laughs> Underneath. <laughs> oh, man. There's not much space, is there? There's not much, not much space to hide anything under there. Um, uh oh. He summoned a foul wriggler uh, to take his place once he's fallen. Um, okay, that's not too much trouble. We'll take care of that. Al, you feeling good? You feeling good? Let's take out some more whites. What do you say? What do you say, Al? You just say, I'll do it, because I'm telling you that's what you have to do, right? Al doesn't have any choice. Um, if he did. Um, I'd be a little, I'd be a little scared, honestly, and I probably wouldn't play this game anymore if I'll had the capability to tell me no. Um, cause I'm like, I'm like his master. He's like my little puppet, and I'm his puppet master. All right, I've made my way down to the southwestern corner of Agamar, and I'm looking for this vessel. I think the vessel of purity. I'm collecting the urn of Agamar. Now it's up here on top of this uh, little landing. I gotta get past some whites. I'm gonna see if I can sneak on by these guys. What level are they? Level 30? I'm only I'm only three levels below. I should be able to sneak by these guys, no problem. Um, maybe. Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, Al. <laughs> Man. <laughs> He's really doing a bad job at his sneaking, isn't he? Um, we're gonna do okay though. We're gonna get out of this area and we're gonna we're gonna have some like uh, easy times up ahead in, in Evendim. Uh, really fun place. Uh, it's a lot nicer looking than this gloomy, murky uh, red pass here in the Lone Lands. It'll be a nice change of pace, I think. I think it really will. Am I doing okay? I'm, I, I need to buy my, uh, my touch and go, or my bob and weave. What is it called? I think it's bob and weave. My, like, passive healing. Um... I need one of these guys, don't I? Oh, no, I don't. I don't. I don't know if I'm going to be able to sneak by them, though. Because he, like, patrols around. There's two of them, actually. Oh, boy. This could be a tough one. This could be a tough one. Let's try to sneak on the left side. Come on, Al. This is a true test, all right? This is a true test of a burglar. Now, we can get back in this corner. And I think we can probably pull this guy... Um, without that gaunt blight collar or whatever being an issue. Yeah? Oh, are you kidding me? Okay, he could, he could become an issue very quickly. Okay, a little bit closer. Thank you. Okay. Doing all right, Al. Hey, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you for taking these steps. Okay. Can I get by this guy? Just get up the stairs. Don't pull him. Please. Come on. Oh, this guy's gonna scream in my face now. Until he dies. 
Look, here he goes. See? I told you. I told you what was gonna happen, didn't I? It's getting very dark and gloomy, isn't it? Um... Oh, man. There's the urn! Um, but here to stop us is Raker, the minion of misery. Um, do you think... Do you think we can beat him? He's a level 31 elite. Oh, boy. Al? Look, I'm diseased. Minus 73 agility. Um, gosh, we might need to wait for this to wear off. Do we have any, um... Okay, look, I can remove my disease. Perfect. Let's, um... Let's put one of these on here just in case he diseases me again. I am going to reveal his weakness to Alcott. Look at all these turbine points I'm getting. Awesome. We're going to use a little bit of a diversion on Riker. So we can sneak up behind him unnoticed. And stab him right in the back. Okay, Riker. We're taking you down, buddy. Um, the minion of misery. Oh, he's disgusting, isn't he? Look, you need to you need to eat a little bit more, buddy. I don't know what people are telling you. You need to believe in yourself, though. You don't have to change your appearance for anyone, okay? Um, gosh, that helmet is really cool, though. I wish. Can I take that helmet when I beat him? Um, I don't think he's gonna mind, right? I mean, he's already dead, but he'll be even more dead. So I I think he definitely won't mind. Look, there we go. I've beaten him. Let's remove our uh, diseases and stuff. Bye, Raker. See you, buddy. Okay, I'm gonna take the urn. Now, what do we have to do? I have to find the Red Maid's altar and fill the urn with water. Um, but I can get some nice stuff. Oh, look at this. I want that knife. I want that knife real bad. Okay, where's the, uh, the Vestal of Purity? It's way over there. Do you think we can do it, though? I think we can do it. Maybe we can, um, maybe we can run all the way over there before we go and take on Gloomleaf. I think let's do it. I think let's try and do it. All right, guys, here we are. We've traveled far through many narrow escapes to get to this point. Some of these guys are tough and they're all like batched up in like groups of twos or threes, which makes it pretty difficult. Um, and now I'm come face to face with these wretched gloom waters. Oh man, they're just running all over the place. Being a nuisance, really. Um, but I found the Red Maid's altar. It's right over there. Now, if I can sneak over to it, I can probably fill up the vessel the urn before they catch on to me and I can run out of here um, a top smasher maybe gosh these guys are patrolling very well aren't they okay let's sneak on in I'm gonna try not to pull this guy on my left I found the red maids altar Al do you need to hop on top oh man too close too close okay let's fill the let's fill the urn all right we've done it Al it's up to you. You and Smasher. Let's get going. <laughs> We've pulled all of the gloom waters. Well, just two of them, actually. Um, and possibly this white as well. <laughs> Let's get back over to uh, Danison, though. Um, because I want that sweet knife that he's going to give to us, right? He better not go back on his word. Because uh, that knife was really cool. And I could really use it. Uh, do a ton more damage. Um, going to be really awesome for Al. Uh, I think it'll give him the confidence boost that he needs to just, like, really, you know, take ownership of his responsibilities as a protector of Middle-earth. Alright, here we go. The Vessel of Purity. We've got the knife. He's very thankful, I think, because we filled up this urn with water. Okay, collect an urn of pure water from Radagast. This is a full-on fellowship quest. Let's just go talk to Radagast and see what he has to say. Speak with the cursed men and save the River Daughter. Where is this? This is probably a, um, oh, I have to go back and talk to Danison again. Okay, I can do that. More inventory overflow. <laughs> it's okay. We'll deal with it. Um, my main goal, though, as I said before, I want to go kill Gloomleaf. I want to take him down. Um, oh, sweet. All right. Awesome. Um, okay, let's go find Gloomleaf. Should we, should we track him down? Yeah, I know he's up here somewhere. Where all the like the horns and stuff, you know, the big like trees, the big mean trees are. Uh, we ran into a lot of them in the old forest, and we're gonna um, we're gonna have to deal with some of them again, probably as we get to Gloomleaf, who is the apparently the Huorn master in this area, um, which is a nice title. I mean, I, I, it comes with a lot of prestige, a lot of respect. 
I think. And I and I do respect him. I do respect Gloomleaf for what he's done in the area. Um, you know, rallying up all the Huorns to like kill anything that that comes by. What the heck? And he stunned me. <laughs> wow. Al, you need to take some notes from this guy, this camouflaged bog prowler. Um, cause man, I was not ready for that. Um, and neither were you, apparently. There's some corrupted stumps here as well. Should we go ahead and take care of this quest while we're here? I say let's do it. Alright, here we are at the edge of Gloomleaf's Den. It's hard to tell right now, but I think the sun is setting. Um, and I don't want to be in here too long after dark, uh, cause it gets a little spooky. Uh, as if it wasn't spooky enough already. So we're going to take out some of these uh, twisted blood oaks. Um, hopefully I'm not going to pull both of these guys at the same time. Because that would really stink. Um, and I don't know if Al could handle it. <laughs> um, I could try to... Uh... There we go. I've pulled one. Perfect. I like how they have faces, right? They kind of have faces. He looks like Oogie Boogie from Nightmare Before Christmas. Remember Oogie Boogie and like his face? I feel like that's exactly what that looks like. There he is. It's just you and me, Gloomleaf. Oh, man. There's a bunch of creeping red roots, too. Do we need to take those out first? We should probably take the roots out first, because they can damage us from a distance. Oh, there's some more right here, too. I hope they don't attack me. Are they all going to attack me? Okay, let's try it. Oh, yeah, they're not attacking us. Perfect. Oh, this is going to be so much easier than I thought, right? Okay, Al. Do what you were born to do, alright? You can't burgle him. Uh, he's got no acorns. He's got no leaves, obviously. You can't steal anything. I, well, I guess leaves are falling, but he doesn't have any leaves in his branches. So I don't know where those are coming from. But um, just, just take him down, buddy. Just have at it. Just let out all your anger. Oh, there we go. Defeated Gloomleaf. And three of seven who warns. Uh, we have to kill some bog prowlers as well. I'm not going to worry about that now. We'll get one more uh, bark strip. And then we'll go back and we'll talk to Radagast. Oh man. He respawned already? That's so not fair. Come on. Okay, let's try to get over here. Um, past this red root. Hopefully we won't pull the red root. And this guy will run back to where he came from. Go on, get out of here. Oh, we pulled the root. Okay, keep going. There we go. Is he going to keep attacking me? Can I get this corrupted stump first? There we go. All right. Okay. Um, now, once he stops attacking me, I can... Um... Gosh. Oh, no. And a camouflage bog prowler <laughs> stunned me. Come on. Need to get out of here. Oh, and I pulled... Oh my gosh. Al, just run. Just run, please. Oh man. It never ends, does it? It never ends. Of course. To help. Please. My friends. I've pulled everything. Help me. Oh, thank goodness. What a nice couple guys. Really helped me out there. Okay. And, of course, I pulled another route. <laughs> Come on, Smasher, let's get out of here. Back to safety. Alright, here we are, back in Radagast Tower, one more time. Um, can we turn in some of these quests? Oh, look, our friend the squirrel. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Where you going? You gonna... You got, got some place to go? Some place to be? Some things to do? No, he just wanted to stand over there. Okay, Radagast. We've accomplished... Our quest of defeating so the fallen oak. The deed is done. Yes, the deed is done. Please don't interrupt. And I can get the band of the brown wizard. Um, plus 18 vitality, which is going to be awesome. I think I'm going to replace my uh, Pengill's discarded shackle, which is from like the beginning of the Lone Lands. Danison's knife. I totally forgot to equip it. Okay. Um, which one do I need to replace? Probably Brace Girdle's Dirk, which is. <laughs> Gosh, was that from like. The Shire? It might have been. It might have been. Okay. We've got our big sword and our tiny knife. Um, you have done well. Thank you, Radagast. Okay. Now, our last quest in this area, I think, is going to be to return back to um, Oscaruth. Should we head on back? 
I mean, I'm midway through level 28 now, so I am still under leveled, but there's lots of questing to do in Evendim. Um, and I, it, it's pretty low key. It's not a lot of fighting at the beginning. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. This is level 31. Let's head back to Oskaruth. Hi everyone. I'm back. Watcher, I'm back. Elsa, I'm back. I know you were waiting for me all this time. No, not Elsa. Hannah. Sorry. <laughs> I get you guys mixed up. I mean, your sisters, right? I don't know anything. I I'm sure. Yes, your sister is very well. I'm going to take... Uh, I'm gonna take her letter to Frederick. Apparently, she's written him like a love letter. You know, they had the, they had like a little thing. How can I be of service? Okay, he's gonna begin preparing a shipment of supplies for Elsa and Ariak, and he's given me Frederick's thanks, which is a nice necklace. Um, boy, nine fate, nine will, nine vitality. Pretty cool. I can't. I my my pockets are too full though. I can't hold it in my pockets. Look at all the people around here. Wow. So busy. Hi, Lily Bell. Look, here we go. Book three. Forward. Fires in the north. We need to talk to Candace. So next time, I think we'll head back there. Uh, and then we'll see where, where we need to go next. If we need to go to Evan Dim or we need to head up into um, the North Downs. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but we'll find out. Hope you guys stick along uh, for the ride. Uh, until then, hey, look. Hey, look, he looks just like Smasher. Hey! What's going on? Oh my gosh. Man, I thought we were so cool and so unique, and it turns out we're just like everyone else. Oh, look, a Bog Guardian. He's so cute. He's so cute. Alright. Until next time, guys. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great night. Cheers! Cheers!